What up, good people? Today is Two Minute Tip Tuesday. Let's get into this video. What type of vehicle that you need to drive in the snow? Front wheel vehicles will get you around in the snow uh, because the engine and the transaxle is sitting right down on the two front wheels. So you are able to guide, so you are able to glide through the snow or drive through the snow. Real wheel vehicles, I learned that out the hard way when I was driving my Genesis Coupe. I'm like, all right, cool, it's snowing. I'm just trying to, I'm just doing normal driving and I'm getting stuck. And I'm like, why well, I'm getting stuck? And I'm like, yo, why I'm getting so stuck in the snow? Come to realize I'm light on my tail. I don't have nothing in the, uh, nothing on my real wheel vehicle that to apply pressure down on the back wheels to give me traction. Yeah. So basically, real wheel vehicles is more for like sports cars. So you light on the tail and you can go. Pew! That's what real wheel vehicles is for. All wheel vehicles is better in the snow too because guess what? You got traction on all four wheels. So you are stable and you can go through the uh, snow however you please. Four by four or four wheel drives, they are two different things. Four wheel drive actually is three wheels driving instead of four wheels. We'll get into that to another video. Trucks, it's good. Not a real wheel uh, vehicle truck, but a four wheel vehicle truck is good. Lifted pickup trucks is ideal, perfect for the snow and all kinds of other uh, conditions. And make sure you have some ground clearance because if you don't have ground clearance and your car is front wheel vehicle and you are low to the ground, yeah, you ain't getting nowhere, bro. Most cars have four to six inches ground clearance. Most SUVs have six to eight inches ground clearance with height adjustment. So, with that said, the more ground clearance you have, the more you can get around in the snow. So if you have the less ground clearance, you're not getting nowhere in the snow. But if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button. If you're not part of our speed fam, go ahead and subscribe button. And yo, welcome to the family. I look forward to seeing you next video.